y'all. What's going on? Happy Sunday. We're going to see what angel messages we have for you. We're going to get right into it. What message do you have for them, Spirit? What messages do you have for them? Oh, oh, wait a minute now. There's a lot. We got successful funding, partnership, no more complaining. So we're going to go with partnership. Allow helpful, supported partnership into your personal life and career. And both parties benefit as a result. You are receiving help from heaven and from a person who brings needed skills and resources. This is giving your person energy, but this is also giving like a business partnership if that's what you've been praying for because we definitely got successful partnership, um, successful funding, okay? But we're going to see what else comes out. What else? It's a partnership developing right now behind the scenes and y'all both will help each other. You know, when you're in a you know, with your kingdom spouse or your divine partner, y'all are supposed to be helpmates. What else is happening? What else, Spirit? Here we go. Bl um, block out distractions. As you can see, that's why. <laughs> block out distractions. Your life purpose and other priorities need your undivided attention. So it's time for you to take charge of your schedule and working environment by turning off electronics and avoiding anyone or anything that distracts you from your important, from what's important. You already know what these distractions are, and you have the power to responsibly block them out. So don't pay them no mind, period. Okay, whatever is trying to distract you from the bigger picture, your mission, block it out. Ignore it. As long as nobody crossing a line, uh, a personal line that's in your personal space, <laughs> block it out, okay? Let people do whatever they need to do to make them feel better in life, okay? Quiet retreat. <clears throat> it's time to disconnect from the outer world so that you can discern and process your true thoughts and feelings from your inner world. Create this quiet time for yourself and you'll have more clarity about what's next. Yeah, somebody is needing to take time to themselves so that they can block out any distractions. Because they got a partnership that's coming into fruition. Open up your heart to receive. Divine order. Archangel Radio. Everything is how it needs to be right now. Look past the illusion and see the underlying order. Everything is falling in place for you. And I mean everything. Balance is being restored in your life, okay? Counselor. Archangel Azrael. You are a natural counselor. And many people benefit from your guidance and reassurance. So make sure that you're reassuring yourself and focusing on yourself at this time so that everything else can just fall in line. Okay? Bars. Let's see what's going on. What you want them to know, Spirit? Okay. Yeah, somebody up in their head. Somebody has been up in their head feeling trapped, stuck, feeling like uh, the world is on their shoulders, feeling like People are against them, people, places, and things. Just caught up in your thoughts, anxiety, feeling trapped or stuck or worried about things that it's just an illusion. Like this person is not really stuck or binded. Okay? Remember to break any curses, spells, or hex. You know, banish any evil beings with evil intentions, okay? Because look, you got happiness that's right around the corner. You have somebody that's about to reach out to you in some kind of way. This person could astral tra travel to you. This could be a Leo. This could be a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Or all the signs are here. This person is on their way towards you. So get up out your head and open up to this partnership. This partnership will make you very happy. You're already spiritually connected. This is actually a miracle that's happening for you. Okay. You have to feel joy and love on your own. Open your heart to receive. So that this can happen. Somebody also could be trying to trap you with a baby. Mm -hmm. This person is on their way towards you. This person had to become more balanced and focus on themselves. With the yin and the yang that's within them. Okay, feeling whole and complete before they came towards you. This could be happening in the cancer season. Shout out to y'all. Happy birthday. Okay, some of you this going to happen during Leo season. Some of you I feel like it's going to happen in between next month. For some of you. For some of you. For some of you, this is happening right now, okay? Take what resonates for you, leave what doesn't. But this person definitely astral travels to you often. Okay, there could have been an ending here, 
this person had to end something. There was an ending to a cycle. This is also trans, trans, um, transformation, transition, metamorphosis. This is a change. This could have been a death of the ego. Um, the ending to a lot of toxic things. I feel like this person is figuring out who they are now in this world. They're no longer the same person that you once knew. They see things different. They look into the world with new eyes. Okay, this could be you and your person. All right, because there was a death here and a rebirth. Okay, somebody has been working on themselves very heavily. Somebody is ready to work on this connection now. After they went through this rebirth, okay, and ended a toxic cycle, okay, they're not willing to give up on you or themselves. Okay, they know that they may have caused you some burdens. And they went through a lot of burdens on their own, okay? But I feel like this person is finally free now. They dropped them burdens. They no longer stressed out about whatever they were stressed out about. So whoever was trying to keep them bound and trapped, they are now free from. Okay? This person may spend a lot of time at work. I feel like that was helping them to keep them occupied. Um, but I feel like this person is its like this undeniable passion ignited for this person. And this is all in divine order. Spirit is bringing all this together. Somebody could have definitely been distracted here, too focused on the negative things and not opening their mind to the positive that was trying to happen for them. Okay, so it's a commun some communication is coming. We got the Page of Wands and the Page of Cups. This is like this loving, passionate communication where this person may open their heart to you and express some things that they've been feeling for a long time and they're feeling very passionate about it. Yeah. Because they don't want you to reject them. They regret rejecting you. Okay? This person has bossed up. This person now wants this partnership with you. This emperor wants this partnership with you. And this is divine order. And it's nothing nobody else can do. They are blocking out distractions. They want some quiet alone time with just you and them. Okay? They've been spending a lot of alone time on their own to figure this out. Okay? And they no longer want to keep rejecting this connection they no longer going against the grain mm -hmm. this person is coming towards you they feel like you are a wish fulfillment they feel like you're very nurturing nurturing and abundant they watch you all the time they watch you while you're at work okay <laughs> all right this person is on their way towards you so open your heart to receive this partnership okay learn how to feel joy and happiness on your own remove the anxiety ask spirit to help you help to heal you okay take some time to yourself and get away because a lot of you are meant to be counselors or um you know somebody here to help others a lot of people may come to you for advice but first you gotta help yourself and take your own advice okay so make sure your your chakras are unblocked and aligned do what's best for you make necessary changes okay because right now, the world needs you, okay? So say a prayer for yourself and your person. Be kind and gentle to yourself and your person. Namaste.